Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, please subscribe. I'd really love that if you're returning. How you doing? Okay, grab your coffee or if you need to hydrate yourself, do that because you're going to need to. I'm drinking lemonade right now. Um, snick snacks. Yes, please. <laughs> um, you know, I know this is a selection year. Okay, I get it. All right. And I am not one to talk politics. I'm really not because, you know, what they always say, you know, you don't mix politics with friends and family. Okay. And I don't do that. But there comes a time when you have to point out the obvious right on. And oh, wow, just wow. Okay. I mean, they're they're all doing their part they're all doing their thing okay i'm talking about 45 46 and then we have um robert kennedy jr okay who is running independent and on thursday the president uh he continued his campaigning and he went to Pennsylvania and he made a stop in Philly. Okay. And if you're in Philly, you probably heard about what happened. Okay. I have family that lives in Philly. And this is the president's, you know, last day in Pennsylvania this week before he returns to the White House. But so far, from what I'm hearing, his stops in Scranton, Pennsylvania and Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania have not been all that fulfilling. A protester was actually removed from his Philly event and I'm not going to show you the video, but you know, listen to what actually happened because I think it's important that you hear what was going on. Um, it's just a sad day. It's a sad, it's a sad thing. It really truly is because, you know, when people go to these events, they want their voices to be heard regardless of who, who the person is regardless of who the candidate is they want their voices to be heard you know they want to go up they want to shake their hands they want to say you know thank you for being who you are or thank you for running or whatever the case may be this is what my issue is and i want you to hear what the issue is because maybe you can address it well that's not what happened okay so take a listen to what happened Okay, because like I said, I can't show it, but you can definitely listen to it. What did I do to you? What did I do to you? I did nothing to stop any trade agreements. This is not free trade agreements. I have rights. I have rights. I have rights. I have rights to be here. I was just wondering what kind of president is this that the nuts best for people? Why do I have to give me rights? I mean, why did you decide? This is my right to be here. Now, as usual, okay, our president, he, he has a hard time, okay, and I'm giving him the benefit of the doubt saying that he has a hard time with giving his speeches, okay, and I'm trying to be nice, okay. And what he said was, I see a future with a planet. Well, yeah, we, we live on planet Earth. Where are you? And he said, we save the planet as this guy busting his neck doing. What? And then he goes on to say, from climate change, literally. Okay. And then he says, oh, he dropped a gem. 
He really did. He said, are you ready to choose freedom over democracy? Because that's America. Are you ready to choose freedom over democracy? Because that's America. Yes. <laughs> well, yes, Joe, that, that is, we are, we are in America. We are. Yeah. I'm glad, I'm glad you realized that. I really, I really am glad that you realize that we are in America and, and you're the top dog right now. You know, you really truly are. So, um, you know, I just, I, I hope that you guys get out there and you, you do your thing, your duty and, and, you know, you, you, you choose you know, wisely, you know, but you know, the, the, the truth. Okay. Um, Let's just hope that the one that we choose, you know, it, it gets in. Um, I did early voting. I did. Uh, will I disclose who I chose? No, I will not because, like I said, I don't discuss that type of thing. Um, did I choose this one? No, I did not. <laughs> God help us all. No. Um, so that that's it you know but you you choose wisely okay all right uh guys that's all that's it that's all i have to say about this um i will see you in the next one okay you stay safe you stay positive you keep prepping and as always fear less but remember um regardless of who gets in there's going to be chaos and crazies and it's just all out hell from here on out. Yeah. Okay. So fear less, guys. As always, fear flip flopping less. Ciao.